All right, good afternoon, Shana. How are you today? Good, thank you. And yourself? I am doing good. All right, I've got your resume here in front of me. You are relocated to the Maitland, Florida area. So we are looking to get started um, in a new career. You've been with Wellbox since 2019 mm -hmm. as their account manager. Tell me a little bit about that position and what you were doing. Just working in sales. It's a newly found company that's been around for about three years or so, maybe, well, no, like four or so. And um, the creator of the company, he actually was working in insurance sales and through companies who pay for part of their company's health insurance plan, okay. there's in there called a wellness credit. And through the wellness credit, they can call Wellbox and have a little care package sent to the employee's home. Like, hey, we, we want to appreciate you and send you this little box with like eight items in it. And I'm the sales rep to coordinate okay. the ins and outs of the whole sale operation that I've had anywhere between say like 10 boxes sent to like 600 boxes, eight, wow. no, 900 boxes sent. Wow. So. All right. Fantastic. <laughs> so in your time working at this company, so mm -hmm. since this was a startup when you first started, were they mm -hmm. measuring your sales metrics or was it get out there and just sell as much as you can? How did they measure success at the company? More of, I mean, more sales. There wasn't really a metric, just do as much as you can. Some they were giving me warm leads or I would get referrals from the warm leads they gave me. Or if I knew a company of like a local, hey, my dad knows this company or so-and-so okay. knows, I then would reach out to them and say, hey, so you pay for part of your company's or your employee's health insurance. And then I'd kind of generate a new lead on my own through gotcha. that. Gotcha. Now, was, were th was this lead generation happening over the phone or on social media or were you doing this face-to-face? Uh, phone, like I, I mean, I'm here in Florida, but I could have called a company in California or Washington and it, okay. it's all remote, remote sales. So there was no drive factor. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Were you working out of a database for? Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Like all digital computer details, either leads would be sent to me email or, Hey, go check our database so and so blah 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 they want they're interested call them and i'd schedule a time meet with them talk to them via phone just kind of hey tell me about your company how many boxes are you thinking what time what's what's the timeline as to you're wanting these boxes to be received by the employees so, okay fantastic details all right i love it and then prior to that you were working at a company called crane institute of america what type <laughs> of work was that they certify crane operators like okay. well, as you saw like the i4 ultimate project or any like buildings being like those crane operators they would go to crane institute to then be certified to operate the heavy machinery and they've been around for like 35 years Great. so just i i was working more on the admin side and also coordinating prospective students to enroll in the classes to then get certified or just your daily in and out admin office details. Okay. So, fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. Dana, at this point in your career, what's the most important thing to you about the next company that you work for? Being appreciated for the work that I do, but yet also feeling that fulfillment of doing a great job and knowing that what I do matters at work. Okay. And we did talk off camera about your salary expectations mm -hmm. and that benefits were important to you. If mm -hmm. offered a position, how soon are you available to start? This week. Okay. Like now. <laughs> You're ready now. Let's rock yeah. and roll. All right. I'm going to go ahead and turn off the recording and then chat with mm -hmm. you about a couple openings that I have, if that sounds good. That does sound good. I look forward to hearing more. 